Hi guys, welcome to Simple Programming. Before we move on to our next set of videos, let us quickly understand what are other rate of component, other rate of service, other rate of repository, other rate of controller, other rate of configuration, and other rate of bin. You have to understand what is the difference between these annotations and where to use them. This is one of the hot topics in Spring Boot interviews. At the rate of component annotation marks a Java class as a bean so that component scanning mechanism of Spring can pick it up and pull it into the application context. At the rate of service behaves just like a component annotation. It doesn't currently provide any additional behavior over the at the rate of component annotation. But it is a good idea to use at the rate of service over at the rate of component in service layer classes because it specifies the actual intent of the class better. At the rate of repository provides a suitable need for DAO layer. It also makes sure that unchecked exceptions thrown in the DAO layer eligible to be translated into Spring Data Access exception. At the rate of controller marks the class as a Spring Web MVC controller, whereas at the rate of risk controller combines at the rate of controller and at the rate of response body which eliminates the need to annotate every request handling method of the class with at the rate of response body annotation. At the rate of configuration marks that the class contains one or more beans defined inside. This is going to be your configuration class. Next, let us look at at the rate of bean. For this, I'm going to create a simple bean here. At the rate of bin is used to explicitly declare a single bin rather than letting Spring do it automatically for us. And this is how you create a bin inside a configuration class. Thanks for watching and please subscribe for more such videos.